There's only, there's only one place to start tonight. There are fighters in boxing that go under the radar again and again and again and again. They get matched in hard, hard, harder fights and so often pull off shocks. In the last six or seven years, there is one fighter that tops my list for being overlooked, underestimated and ignored. His name is Colin Lyons. And last night, he did it again. Colin won back the British welterweight title in a fantastic fight that you'll call. Colin beat Lee Purdy. He was the champion. Now Colin is the champion again. I'm delighted to say that he is on the line right now. Colin, Colin, Colin. Now, every single time they think you're finished, you just go out there and grab a title. I love it. That's it, Bunsy. I love a challenge, and they do it every time, and I've watched for the challenge, and I'm, I'm there. Yeah, I mean, th this time, Colin, in all fairness, and I was talking to Barry Hearn earlier on, on FA Cup Matters, and he agreed with me. We think it was one of your best, if not your best, performance. That's it. I, f I was fighting like it was my first title fight, not my 14th. Oh, 33 years of age. A bit marked up at the end. How's the, how's the uh, bruising and the swelling and stuff? OK, today, yeah, I've been pampered today all day by the missus and, that, and, the, and the kids have, have been around me and it's been great today. But, oh. uh, yeah, a bit marked up. I don't know whether that is with the age I am now. That the body doesn't like being hit afterwards, but... Uh, yeah, that all heals up, and uh, it's much better being in a position of a champion. Yeah, of course, it's nice to, like, nice to look in the mirror and see the bruising, knowing you've got a Lonsdale belt That's in the it. other room, eh? Definitely, definitely. Now, this one, this wasn't... I mean, a lot of your fights, you know, when you've gone on the road or you've taken fights at shorter notice and against against the odds, but you had enough warning for this one? This one was, you know, straightforward in that sense? Uh, it wasn't straight. There was a lot of politics behind the uh, yes. scenes. Uh, Vassell was his mandatory, and That's for whatever right. reason... He didn't want the fight, uh, but he didn't put notice in until last minute. And I think Purse Bids went out for another fight to take place, yep. Purdy versus uh, Gavin or whoever. Yep. And uh, we just got in there, and uh, Vassell pulled himself out of the running, which enabled Purdy to have a defence, a uh, voluntary. And that's where I stood up, because I don't think there was many people that wanted to face, was in a rush to face Purdy right now. But mm. I'm always relishing the challenge. And uh, four to six weeks notice I had. And uh, I got myself in, well, I say I got myself, the Tibbs has got, Tibbs got you in shape. Now, also, also, uh, Big Cole, had you sparred? Had you spent some time with him in the past? No, never, no. I mean, uh, a lot of people would interviewed me because he only lives sort of down the road, really, 10 miles, 13 miles down the road. To maximum. Yeah. I've never come across him before, sparring, amateur or, or pro, no. So it, was, it really was the first, oh, that's amazing, that, because you'd think you'd be in enough gyms and you'd be... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, listen, yeah. I've got to tell you, Cole, I mean, I, 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 I didn't have a show last week. That's why you weren't on my show. I didn't have one because Spurs were playing uh, some pub team from Iceland in the European Cup that they're in, and uh, and they took me off off air for it. Right. Um, but that's why you weren't on. But you, I tell you what, I'm, I'm, I never, ever am going to sell you short again, and I never do sell you short. I just hope a few of my colleagues... We'll realise what a warrior you are. Yeah, I think I left him there because the noise that was made in your call last night, I think everybody wants me on their shows, topping bills. So uh, I'm really looking forward to it. It's, it's a new lease of life, even at my right bold age. Ah, listen, you're young in boxing. I'll tell you what I want to do, though, Colin. I want to get you on this and my other show. I'm going to get you in the studio, get your belts there, and we'll sit down and have 15 minutes, and we'll go over all those mad fights in the last six or seven years you've been involved with. How's that sound? Yeah, fantastic. It's going to make me feel young, is it, Will? Ah, oh, listen, I wish... I, hold on, I'm just going to ask my sound man. Have we got any fabulous music we can play Colin out with? Not three times a lady, but something from Rocky or something like that. I want, I want Colin to go off tonight with his bruised eyes and his Lonsdale belts happy. Yep, Give me on. something. Hold on, Colin. I'm trying to find you something here. The sound man was asleep. I had to wake him up. Sorry about, sorry about that. Have we got anything? Oh, I'm just going to say goodbye. One second, Colin. It's coming. No problem. Here it comes. Oh, there we go, Colin. That's it. Colin Lyons, what Thank a pleasure. You. Back oh. in the ring already. Back in the ring, Colin. Put that Lonsdale belt down, take your bandages off, and go and give your wife a kiss. See ya, Cole. Colin Lyons, eh? Every time you underestimate him, he just sucks you back in, which is nearly a quote from a famous film.